President Trump has publicly described the concept of climate change as a hoax, and that was one of his reasons for announcing his intention of withdrawing the U.S. from the Paris Climate Accord. The Paris Climate Accord is simply the latest example of Washington entering into an agreement that disadvantages the United States. But he's directly contradicted by a report that maintains the U.S. is experiencing more heat and rainfall events, that 25 coastal cities experience more flooding, and that seas could rise by between one and four feet by the end of the century. All a consequence, says the report, of human action. One of those who had to sign off on the report is a director of the Environmental Protection Agency. Yet at his Senate confirmation hearing, Scott Pruitt indicated he too was a climate change skeptic. Let me say to you, science tells us that the climate is changing, and then human activity in some manner impacts that change. The ability to measure with precision the degree and extent of that impact and what to do about it are subject to continuing debate and dialogue. Pruitt has led the way in promoting fossil fuel production and rolling back several Obama-era rules aimed at curbing carbon output and limiting greenhouse gas emissions. Action, the report says, contribute to global warming. The director of the EPA did not stop there. He ordered the removal of climate science pages that for two decades had featured on the agency's website. For these reasons, some had feared the national climate assessment would be blocked by an administration it contradicts. But instead, it appears that rather than prevent publication of the report, President Trump and his fellow climate change doubters have simply decided to ignore it. Mike Hanna, Al Jazeera, Washington.